Four favorite movies. Oh, Jesus. Gosh, okay. Um, I can come up with four that I love. I'll go with, uh, my God. I'm going to start with the Lord of the Rings movies. I'm going to count them all as one. That's cheating, but I'm doing it anyway. Oh, my God. I love Beverly Hills Cop by Eddie Murphy. Do the Right Thing. Uh, Sweet Smell of Success. I love The Untouchables. I love The Notebook. I love The Godfather. I'm a huge musical boy, so I have to reference The Red Shoes by Palin Pressburger. Um, I love John Carpenter's The Thing. That's something I have good to make choice, everyone watch choice. when I'm with them. That's a great one. Um, Citizen Kane, Godfather 2, Apocalypse Now, Singing in the Rain. Indiana Jones and the Temple of Doom. Last Tango in Paris. Del Toro's Pan's Labyrinth. Mm. The Last King of Scotland. Star Wars. A New Hope. Baraka. Mm. Uh, I won't say anything you just said, so I'll go with, uh, my God. Uh, I saw all the good ones. I guess Close Encounters. That's a good one. Mr. Spielberg was here earlier. And because Mr. Scorsese was here earlier, I'm also mm. gonna go with Taxi Driver. Ooh. Mix it up a bit. Next, I'm gonna do The Princess Bride. That one's mm. just like an old favorite. My family has watched it so many times I can quote every part of it. Um, so then also one of the movies that has to be up there for me is The Prince of Egypt. First movie I saw in theaters, uh, blew me away, still does all the time. Oh, I love Rocky Three by Sylvester Stallone. Nice. Yeah. I love Rocky cause I'm a boxer and it's a story of uh, a man from failure to success again. It's a story of not giving up and I love the courage that it evokes in me. I'm gonna go with Memento. Ooh. He was here earlier. Yeah, right. Love Jones. Whoa. Crooklyn. Okay. I love that Mike Lee movie, Another Year. I love Tony Erdman. Working Girl is a great one. Tootsie, I don't know. I'm not gonna say like Dr. Zhivago or Citizen Kane. I, I, I was going to. I love um, uh, the film Heaven's Gate by Michael oh, Cimino so very cool. much. And that's always floating around in the top, I would say maybe top five. I love the movie uh, Fanny and Alexander. So I, I'm Swedish, so I'm automatically in the club, but uh, I think it's just, they play it in, on Swedish television every Christmas, every Christmas. Gosh, I want to pick an anime. It's so oh. hard. I think I'll go with Princess Mononoke. Good choice. Miyazaki, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that one was very formative for me when I was a kid. Adam Iboshi, is that her name? The yes. villain in Princess Mononoke? Yes. Mm. I was love her. I've been watching a lot of Totoro recently. My neighbor Totoro, because uh, we have young kids, and and also I love that world. I love the music in that movie is incredible. Amelie was, you know, oh, it was right. had a big impression with music again, and also everyone obviously fell in love with uh, with the, the main actress, the Deer Hunter. Uh, also a great movie, uh, and also love the, the love the music in that film too. So, same composer, same director as Heaven's, Heaven's, Heaven's Gate. Gate. Yeah. Oh, he made Heaven's Gate after I... he made uh, Deer Hunter. On Deer Hunter was kind of small and very successful. And then he got all the money in the world, all the recognitions, all the crew. He could shoot as long as he liked and he made Heaven's Gate. And oh, Heaven's wow. Gate became a huge flop. Oh. And it has grown yeah. through, the, through the years. So it's a... Can't wait to watch it. It's yeah. a really fun watch. Okay. Real intermission. It's also very low. It's very yeah. neat. No, it's like epic. You'll love it. Okay, wow. I have one that, yeah. uh, in, in, that is also floating around in my uh, top five that you, you might like. And Sherlock's Historia. Oh, yeah. What's that? Roy Anderson. Roy Anderson. Oh, the Roy Swedish Anderson. love story. Yeah. Yeah. What's it? It's called the Swedish love story. Oh, the Swedish love story. You just yeah. said it in Swedish at first, yeah. so I couldn't understand. <laughs> I mean, if we're talking Swedish, I would also say, mm. let the right one in. Yes, that you know, I was done. just talking about it's the movie. It's so good. Husband. It's so beautiful. The Swedish version. Yeah. The movie that I think I've seen more than any other movie that is probably my actual favorite movie out of all of these is Queen Latifah's Last Holiday. <laughs> it is a great movie. Watch it. Full Metal Jacket. The Holdovers. The Holdovers this year, I just found profoundly moving and beautiful and kind of inspiring at the same time and, and just wonderful. What have we done? Love Jones, Crocklin, except Memento. Just make me. one up, sound really, really. Gonna, 
Um, oh, wow. Next he just made that up. Yeah, Not doesn't even. exist. <laughs> no. He's just looking it. for movies. Yeah. where you add he's just trying to sound clever now because I said Star I was, Wars. No, he's trying to go all Criterion on it. <laughs>